Hello everybody and welcome back to Coral Island where today I think we're going to try and see like we have made so much progress down those mines. I think I'm going to try and see if we can uh, get those sorted today. It looks like our potatoes are ready for a harvest. Do you know what that means, don't you? It means that we've got to go over and see Pablo and Raphael and get this upgraded while we've got a change of seasons so that when we come into summer, we can have a nicely upgraded watering can. Yells, yells. It's going to be so good. Um, and that should, that should help us be able to make a bit more profit as well and uh, run along a bit faster. We are nearly at, like, enough money to do two upgrades. Um, I don't think you can do more than one at once. So basically, as soon as this is done, I'm pretty sure we'll be able to go and do the scrap hook. Which makes me wonder whether I should do diving today because then we're going to... Nah, it's fine. We'll do mining. I don't mind. Yep, that's what we'll do. So... No watering today. Wonderful. We also need to find Mark wherever he is and give him his three pieces of stone. <laughs> and that'll maybe get me some merit points or something. Let's see if we can find where he is at the moment because obviously the uh, blacksmith shop won't be open yet. He's just over there. So And there's a stranger up, up, up at the steps. Let's go and see who they are. Because I haven't met everybody yet. There's a, still a person or two that I'm just missing so, I'll find who this person is. Well, there's Mark. Where's the stranger gone? Oh, they've gone down into the town. Oh! Okay, where are they now? Well, on that way. All right, okay. Is it you? Is it that little dog? Is it you? Are you the stranger? Taco? You say hello to Taco the dog. He seems to like it, and that's all that matters. Was, were you the stranger? I think you were, cutie pie. Uh, where's Mark now? Mark's gone into the community center. Okay, let's go find him. Right, where is he in here now? At the desk in here. This is the pet rescue by the looks of it. I can adopt a pet here. Oh my goodness. And you can buy little pet houses and little pet dogs. Oh, I love it. I'm here to take care of the shelter. He's like a fighter who looks after puppies. Now this is the sort of information I need when I'm making romance choices. <laughs> okay. What? Pick up a broom, help out. Summer's almost here. I might need to change up my gear. Right, let's give you your <laughs> quest item. Stone to complete errand. Thank you. Well, I mean, that's definitely put Mark up there for someone that... An that, uh, animal lover. That, that gives me a tick on the tick box, definitely. Right then. We've done that little quest a Rooney. I've got a few things that I can sell. Some more. I've got another um, bronze thing to sell. Fantastic. It's nearly nine o'clock, so it's definitely going to be time now to go and upgrade this watering can. Oh, assuming I remembered. To, to of course, it didn't remember to bring the copper bars and the wood and everything I need. Why would I do that? Why would I? Why would I remember to bring the stuff I need for the specific task I'm doing? Okay, knit back to my house. Let's uh, go to the building materials chest, get five bronze bars. I'm going to need to cut down another tree as well. Um, those spikes, I'm going to put them in with the monster loot because I don't think I'm going to really be using them a ton. Uh, Earth geodes, I think, need to go with, with donations because they're going to get cracked open eventually. Uh, building materials for the bronze copper. Monster loot for the slime goop. We've got enough to hand that in now. Need some more monster essence though. And we need more tough meat and more silky fur. Things like that. So we do need to do some more fighting in there. Oh yeah, and I can put the stone away as well. Okay, so I want to keep some potatoes. But I want to definitely sell that bronze starred one. Uh, produce. Uh, 
actually no. We've got a few potatoes to put by just in case I need them, so I will sell the rest. And then let's go chop down a tree. Or chop a few logs. I need to get rid of... Tw I need 20 total. So what are we on now? We're on 12. Might as well get rid of the debris, right? I can't really get to the wood in some places. There we are. Plenty. Right, okay. Let's, let's, let's head back to the backsmith then. They're only open till like... Uh, two or something on a Saturday so I need to make sure I make sure I uh hurry up Saturday morning yoga is go and it looks like uh taco taco is taco is doing the yoga as well taco is busy look <laughs> that's hilarious taco I love you you're my favorite don't tell the cats don't tell peanut and butters Hey Paolo, I'm trying to persuade my cousins to expand the inn's business. Oh, so the people at the inn are your cousins? Maybe they could add karaoke, let people choose songs and sing along. They keep turning me down. Didn't see the potential, I guess. Oh. And yeah, I know that I can I can do more than one chat to people, but sometimes if they're just like, if I'm on my way somewhere, I'll just, I'll chat to them once. If I'm busy doing lots of chatting, then I'll chat to them twice. Right, so. Upgrade tools, and we need to do the watering can, and we have... Oh, I didn't need wood for it. It looks like I need wood for everything else, though, so I'll need to remember that. And it looks like when I get to gold level, it's going to be hardwood required. So I'll have to find that, but, you know, it'll be a while before I find gold anyway, so I'm sure by then I'll have opened up some other woodland or something. But yeah, definitely want to upgrade this watering can. It'll be worked on and ready in one day. So we'll pick that up Monday, I think that'll be ready. I think they're closed on a Sunday anyway. So we'll pick that up on Monday morning um, and we'll pick up a load of seeds from Sam at the same time. And if I've got any money left over after all of that, then I will um, upgrade the scrap hook. If not, then I'll just you know, I'll put it all into planting basically. And then we'll see, we'll see how it goes. Right, so now I want to head back to my farm, put away this wood into my chest, and then I want to go and do... I kind of feel like I should chat to people. Now that I'm home, I don't get to fly as much. I miss it. I'm itching to get back in the cockpit. But you're a pilot. Oh, yeah. You've got like a kind of pilot's uniform on. I wouldn't let Mama hear me say that, though. She seems to think I'm home for good. It'll be easier for her if everyone... <laughs> for everyone, sorry, if we let her th keep thinking that until I have to leave again. Chat to Leah. Ugh, spring. Ugh, spring. Ugh. Okay, they're yogaring again. Antonio, spring is when retailers like myself get new clothing catalogs. Spring and fall, actually. I make decent amount of money from my store. Well, I used to anyway. When there were a lot of tourists before the oil spill incident. Oh, so he has like the clothing store then, I'm guessing. Starting to get an idea about people a bit more now, uh, which I'm guessing I didn't do too much last time because I don't feel like I knew that Alaya was a pilot and I don't feel like I knew that like Mark ran the, ran the adoption centre and I don't feel like I ever, maybe I did join the Band of Smiles, I'm not sure. I feel like there's a lot of stuff I'm finding out this time that I didn't find out last time. It might have been that th those things weren't even in the game. You never know. Right, okay, let's head down the mines. And see if we can get a bit further this time. It's it's good because today I didn't have to do any watering. Oh, and I've got my reward from the Band of Smiles, apparently. I'm terrible at picking up rewards. 20 merits and 9 corals and some uh, relationship. Oh, relationship with Mark, look. That's why. Yes. Nice, nice, nice. So we've still got another 12 items to put into the museum. I've got to find the earth giant. 
We still need to uh, heal another 14 coral sites. And I'm still slowly but surely shipping quality fruits and vegetables off. But that, that one I think is going to take a while. I don't think that's going to just happen quickly for me. <laughs> I expect there are probably some fish that I will only be able to catch in the spring. I am happy. I'm just going to unhook my controller because it keeps annoying me. It keeps coming up and annoying me. Um, there are probably some fish that can only be caught in the spring, but I do intend to play a second year, probably, or at least until spring of the spring of the second year. I don't think I'm going to be finished before then, so I think it's okay to not be so like into the collections at the moment. But I will definitely be looking to get them done year two. I'm going to be looking to definitely get the first altar completed in the first year, though. I think I think otherwise you just end up being all so focused on the collections that you don't get anything else done. And I think in the first year it's important to make money in things. I wish there was like a way to pick up those coins. I feel like they should be pick upable, but they just don't seem to be. They seem to be decorative. If you guys know of a way I can pick up the coins, let me know in the comments, but I don't think it's something I can do. Nice. You're quite a, a good guy. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. So remember to use the fact that I can basically cheese it a bit. Ow. You know what, I'll just face tank your damage. I don't care today. You gonna drop me anything? No. Ugh, oh, how dare. I want some, like, tough meat off you or something. But I think the thing to do is, because you've only got a certain amount of health points, um, you just want to take a few out every time you're down here, rather than coming in and doing one massive load of of fighting. You want to just fight just enough, take a few of them out, and then take a few of them out the next day. So I want to try, try and like combine that a little bit. Oh, I'm not finding my way down. Oh, let me to let me to level 32, please. I need to get there. Halfway through my blinking. I think the next shaft I'm not going to be able to do without food. I've got a strong suspicion. Oh, I am having terrible luck today. Let me down. I've had some really good luck uh, with some of these things. That was a good one. I liked that. That was good. Where's the way down here? I'm gonna have no stamina left at all. I'll have loads of rock though. I'll be able to like stone path my entire farm. Oh my goodness, it's like night time already. And I'm still getting through the first layer. Uncover it and not realize, did I, or something? Sometimes it's literally the first stone you click on, and then sometimes it's like miles away. So annoying. So I've not got a lot left, but I'll try just in case I can. But not being able to find the way down for that one was terrible. It really didn't help me at all. Yes, the way down. Okay, so we might still be able to do this if we're lucky.
Right. One more to find. Not much stamina left at all. And as usual, I clear my inventory and I don't bring down anything to eat, which is always terrible when you get to this stage. Yeah, <laughs> so oh, the luck was with me. The luck wasn't with me on the other levels, but it was with me on this one. Perfect. So we're on level 35. And there is still a way down. So I, my thoughts are, ow. Ooh, ooh. Didn't mean to run straight into you. My thoughts on it are that we have to go to level 40 and that 35 is the last shortcut. So I don't think I'm going to be able to do it today. So I will have a look around. I will grab any copper that I see. Any bronze, sorry. Not copper, is it? It's bronze. I'll grab any bronze I see and then we'll head back, I think. Oh, here's some. Nice, 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 nice. Get you out of the way, though. I might take you out as well, because sometimes I've, you've dropped things for the goddess before. But I'm guessing it doesn't drop every time. But it did this time. Nice. That's my second piece of tough meat. So that's another one for the monster loot section of the goddess's uh, requirements. I could jump into level 37. See what's down there. Maybe there'll be another one, another dude to beat up or get me some monster loot. Never know. I've still got plenty of health, so let's see why not. Might not be able to get that crack in the ground. I don't have the stamina for it, but we've done really well. Done really, really well. I think we might have this cracked tomorrow. I'm going to come back tomorrow and finish it off. I know I've been a bit mine heavy lately, but like I just, I can, I can almost sense the end of this mine shaft coming up, and I've never had the story on it before, so I'm really intrigued. Right, that's it for me. Let's find the way out. Let's find the rope. I'm gonna, gonna keel over. I'm super happy to have not only got down five levels, but to have also managed to get myself a little bit of extra bronze as well. We managed to get 11 pieces of bronze, another piece of my monster loot that I needed for the goddess as well. Happy with that. Had much worse days. <laughs> and we got Mark's quest done. So yeah, I'm going to focus on the mines for now until we get to the end of the earth shaft and then I'll probably switch over to focusing on diving. I like to focus on one thing at once a bit more because then I feel like you kind of make more progress on that one thing. I don't know. I feel like, um, oh no, no, that's a bad idea, Sheila, I'll go to bed. Um, I feel like I need to take away that field on the edge and put the one back in that has uh, degraded. Okay, so we earned 20 merits from Mark's quest. We got relationship points with Pablo from that one conversation I had. And I earned 600 uh, coral coins. I don't know what their name is, the coral coins. Let's have a look at the TV. Spoils of the land. Yeah, forest, forest, rivers. Tilapia was the one that I really needed for the goddess. But the other ones, that's that's cool, you know. I will need them eventually. I need all of them eventually. But I just don't need to be too um, sweaty, would be the word. I don't need to be too sweaty about fish and things like that, like this early in the game. I haven't even got, like, furniture in my house or a chicken coop yet. You know what I mean? Why am I getting sweaty about collections at that point this seems a bit silly 
Right, so uh, the weather forecast says it's going to be sunny tomorrow. We've had so much sunny weather. I'm glad that I put the watering can in when I did. We can't get it today. We can get it tomorrow. So we'll have it at the end of this episode. Uh, and did you know the Coral Talk Show? Are we going to be talking about Landslide again? Yes, we are. So uh, how about we don't? Because I heard about him before. Nothing to water today. Oh, yes, but we've got a harvest of sugar cane. Because it's the last day of spring now. So these will, I think, be wilted by tomorrow. So we may as well uh, do a little sugar cane sale. I've got a silver one. I don't know if silver ones count, but maybe they do. Hope they do. So I've got another geode. So that's going to help towards the museum. Uh, and then monster loot, I've got another piece of tough meat. So I think when I get to something like five tough meat and I've got five slime group and I've got five monster essence, that'll be time to go to the goddess with those then. And uh, we don't have much silky fur though, do we? I'm just going to have to like run around trying to find dudes to kill in the mines, I guess. Uh, I have not put everything away. I'm going to do my usual. I am going to go in again with like no food because I am dumb like that. But also I believe that I can, I can get down to level 40. Uh, but I, I really should use the fast travel. I believe I can get down to level 40 without help of extra food. Uh, if I'm wrong about that, then sorry. I've got a full stamina bar. I think. Yeah. Full stamina bar. So let's go. While we don't have crops to worry about. What? I got to level 35. Why is it not giving me... Alright, well I'll try. But this is going to be harder than I thought. I was dead impressed with myself for getting to 35, but apparently no. No, we don't do that now. Ugh. All right then. Let's hope. Let's hope for luck today, basically. be more methodical and do things nearer the entrance because I'm find I'm finding there are more holes down closer to the entrance so when I get impatient and I like sort of do things that are far away it becomes less likely that I'm going to find the way down I don't know if that's a genuine thing if that's really how it's working but it, it feels like it's working that way to me so I'm going to try and radiate out from the beginning. Now, this might end up being the one that scuppers me. Okay, I'll go a little bit over this way. Nice. I hate it when the rock domino goes in, but I've still done a swipe with my axe. Okay. For this one, I'm going to just get you. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. Yes. Tough meat. Tough. Me Yay! I got a tough meat. So even if I don't manage to get anything else, I at least got one more thing for the goddess. On way down, please. Over 
this way now. Just a little bit on this side. Oh nice, so I got a free I've got a freebie at 35, but you don't get an elevator. That sucks so bad. Okay, so we're on 37. Thirty-eight. It's not there, so we'll work this way onwards then. Trying to be careful for the rock domino effects. got I think two more levels to go before I maybe get an elevator but these are getting harder as well uh, mind you at least this isn't I say like at least this isn't a huge level it's massive Okay, I got 122. I'm gonna left. I just need to get down one more level, I think. Okay, stuff is happening, stuff is happening. This is definitely the bottom then. It's gotta be, I think we've finished the earth shaft. Yeah, yeah, cause that's the wind shaft that's just opened up. Okay, but what is this? I think I broke it. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, I think it got broken. Oh, hello, giant. The giant got down here. Who am I to succeed? Who am I to succeed? Hers it is that make the giant stone. Clear it, human have. Excited to see other giants I am. Where's the other giant? Ah, giant, late to come. Upstairs, earth giant is. Come, human, we'll see. I should have took the chest before I went over there. Oh, well. I think I can come back down. Oh, okay, that's fine. I'm still here. No problem. What's in this chest? For Jammu. What's Jammu? Gives me extra stamina, extra, and then 300 stamina replaced and 130 health. That is some good stuff. I will keep it for a special occasion. This is why you never give me consumables. Let's go up to the top then. So we have finished 
The Earth Cavern! I'm so pleased. I was so, so low on stamina by the end. I was hoping I didn't have to do some big fight or something. Goom goom! A statue's missing. Missing it isn't, human. Free is Grog now. I freed Grog! Hmm, but where is Grog? Here he is not. He's gone for a walk. Chieftain! Hi, Grog! Oh, there is Grog! Oh, they're hugging! Oh, they're too cute! Ah, there is human. Wait, human can see Grog? Yes, but nice human this is. Free Grog, because this human... Human this Grog, Earth Giant. Goom goom, human, I am Grog. Thank you for freeing Grog. <laughs> I'm getting confused now. Main thing is we free Grog! Hmm, but st still stone is other giant. Curse again it must be. Hmm, but fire giant where? Free other giants, human must. Wait, we'll go Grog and I in village. Goom goom, human. Goom goom, chieftain. I love them so much. Free the water giant. I don't think I'll have the stamina for that today, but we can now go into these mines, the water shaft, and try and get down there and free the water giant. And like I say, I think I'm going to need probably... Why am I stuck on this? Oh, come on. There we are. Um, and it looks like there is then a wind shaft there, and that looks like it might be the fire shaft. I think. But yeah, we finished the earth shaft today. Hurrah! Still got a little bit of time to have a chat to people and stuff. Mark gave me the lowdown on the cavern. With more gates open, there's a shot at getting some top-notch ores. Hand them over and I'll make your tools sharper than ever. Well, we're getting there with the tools. Um, I'll be, yeah, I'll hopefully be able to get some silver tools from there, I'm thinking. I'm never going to be able to get a bug net that will help me catch these guys. I think that was just a tiger one, so I, I, I think that's one I've already got. But I swear, like, sometimes it just doesn't want me to catch them. I believe that later on, though, I need to try and catch whatever I can catch. Like, if I see ground insects and things like that, ones that might be an easier catch for me, I need to get this level up so I can start to try. That wasn't working at all. Uh, so I can at least try and see if I can get to a point where I can make traps and then maybe I'll be able to trap some of the harder to catch ones instead of having to try and get them with a bug net. The bug net is hard. So, I'm back at my place. I don't know why I didn't just take my... I, I don't know. I don't know. Um, Does fishing take stamina? I think it does. could eat some of my my jamu juice but I, I really don't actually want to <laughs> so I've got one more tough meat so we're on three of five also three of five monster essence I'll put my jamu in there just in case I have a time when I need it maybe trying to get the last few levels of each of the caverns having a jamu with me might be really useful then or if there's something particularly difficult in the oceans, maybe, as well. Am I missing a tool? I've got one, two, three, four, five. My axe, pickaxe. Oh yeah, of course I'm missing a tool. My watering can's missing. Duh. Right then. Um, yeah, like I say, I'm just trying to think what to do with like zero stamina. I really want to start like getting some stuff for cooking. I don't really want to be just eating raw ingredients. I want to be doing something with them. Maybe I could uh, go and 
buy something to eat. I don't know whether that's useful either. See, I think bug catching's all right. I even catch flies now, apparently. How do I suck so much? Literally. Let's have a look at my quests as well, see what I need to be doing. So it's now uh, Petrified Giant 1. I need to claim my reward. 150. Nice. Um, still exploring the ocean. We're trying to find the second giant. Uh, expand the museum. Get local produce. And also explore the ocean. So they're all big main quests at the moment. I don't think there's anything on Sam's board today. As far as I can tell. Oh, there is something actually. Let's have a look. Uh, errand. Cauliflower. No, that won't be happening. Sorry, Millie. I'm going to be better at keeping um, keeping produce. I've got a produce chest now. Uh, it's just anything other than cauliflower I can do. And so, of course, it's cauliflower they asked for. I've kept a few of, like, everything else. And as I get a bigger farm, I'll be able to keep more as well. Keep more aside. Who are you? Have I talked to you? You look a do like a dog I haven't I haven't talked to. Bonbon is one adventurous pup. You see him everywhere. Do I... Uh, in my journal, other maybe extras? Yeah! All the different... All the different ones. Yeah, is the chieftain on here? No, he's not. Hmm. So we've got a beastery. I found a few of them. Not all of them. You can see what kind of things they drop. So. A slime tuku tuku. A bronze tuku tuku. A scully. All of them potentially drop um, monster essence. But it seems to be only the armadillo -y guys. And we will need to do this caterpillar caterpillary guys for the silky fur so it's really good that that's showing me what they drop um i didn't realize that so now i know which monsters to particularly go for if i'm going for a little run around the mines and i can go in and fight monsters on level one one five ten fifteen twenty twenty five and thirty without actually having to dig anything so I think that shouldn't be too difficult to do. I should go to the hot springs for a minute. I should also keep more of an eye out for bugs. Hey, I caught one. Nice. Not like me. But I think the game probably is designed for you to catch the easy catches first and then like as you progress. If you were able to catch all of them straight away, there'd be no point in leveling, would there? I love that they've got like little bedrooms and things in here and then like Takeba's room. Or Takaba, I'm not sure how that is pronounced. But if I head in here, oh, I can chat to Leah. Let's see, what a, what's a good spring look? Something flowy, definitely. Oh, a nice pastel makeup tone. What else? What else? Maybe he's dropping on me. Of course you would. Yeah, I need to know what the fashions are too. So I figure if I spend a little bit of time in the hot springs, then I'll have enough stamina by the time I come out to do a little bit of uh, hoeing the land before, before I go to bed. I can sell my leaf beetle as well. But yeah, my bug catching is uh, is not going great. I don't really need like to stay in here forever because otherwise it'll get too late at night as well. But that really, yeah, I feel like I've done really well getting that whole shaft finished already. It's not even the end of spring. I'm just, like so happy with myself for that. I don't know if that's good or bad or, or what, but I feel like it's good. We've done, like, loads of the diving as well. 
I do need to be starting to take these up as well. Yeah, definitely. I need to get better at food. Um, and for that, I'm going to need things like my, my knife and things like that. I try to see my friends after work most days just to take the edge off. That's nice. Bit of compost. I should be making fertilizer really for all my crops as well. It's another thing that I'm just failing to do and should be doing. Probably have the stuff for as well, so... Do, do I have a compost bin though? I don't, do I? So how do we make a compost bin? I know that I've got the ability to. Yeah, let's just make one. Great. Okay, I'm going to pop that down. And then we can make some compost to put onto our uh, crops. So trash and organic items into compost. And then compost. Oh, how do I make compost into... So that's a compost bin. How do I then make the compost into... Oh, is it just a crafting recipe? Uh, into fertilizer, sorry. Oh yeah, compost and sap into fertilizer. Oh yeah, I've got a little bit of fertilizer now. I'll put that in my produce chest. Nice. So if I've got enough sap and compost, and the compost can be made out of trash, oh, that's great. Got a few wild seeds that I can sell on in, uh, well, I can plant in winter and then sell on. See, the only thing I would say with that is that isn't it better sometimes to not have things um, to grow in winter so that you can just be like free as the wind? <laughs> but then there's probably some crops that you can't, that you can only get in winter that you could get with the wild seeds but that you wouldn't get at other seasons or something. So maybe that's the reason why to save them all. I don't know. But we'll see. We'll see when it gets to winter, won't we? I have learned how to make stone soup. Very nice. I'm getting all these recipes, but I don't know how to actually make the things. I'm guessing I need some ki kitchen equipment. So, um, ooh. Who dis? There's a new person in town, I think. They are... Oh, Nina! My darling flower, Lily, I miss you so much. Is that Lily's mum? It's going to be a fun summer now you're here, or Lily's friend, maybe? Probably find out by chatting to people about stuff. then i got stone soup from freeing the water giant from freeing the earth giant i think that would make sense wouldn't it the animal channel mook bang with mook uh yeah we've seen that one uh how to be a farmer with jeff smith it's hot pepper season it's a special one let me tell you why hot peppers are a multi-season crop meaning they won't wither at the end of summer they'll continue to produce until the end of fall Ooh, let's get a few of those in. It's a no-brainer, ain't it? Hot pepper crops all the way. Thanks, Jeff. Good to know. I'll have to pick up my watering can before I can do anything, though. Weather forecast is going to be rainy tomorrow. Nice. So that'll be a good chance to get in the mines or get in the water and dive for a bit. I think uh, we're a bit more behind on the diving than we are on the mining, so... Giants forget human can't enter village. Come to village. I open for human. Grog. Oh, go to the giant village. Okay, well, the first thing I want to do... Oh, you know what? I went to bed. I got all that stam stamina from the hot springs and I didn't even do any of this. Mind you, it looks like a lot of it got wrecked overnight, so if I had done, I think it probably would have all got wrecked anyway. Probably need my scythe to get rid of those. Yeah. So I'm thinking the sprinkler might be good for the hot peppers. I'm also thinking that it might be good if the hot peppers are something that um, stays for a while. I'm thinking it might be a bit like the bamboo. 
So it might be good to leave a space for sprinklers if I'm going to have a couple of fields worth. That would totally make sense, I think. Right. I need to go get my uh, watering can, don't I? Hopefully by the time I've run over there, it'll be time to put that in the produce chest. It's kind of like a farming chest for me. Uh, eventually I'll need more than one. I'll need like a flower one, a vegetable one, a farming stuff one. Or I'll need bigger chests. One or the other. I'm going to try and catch this fly. Because I need the practice at catching flying insects. I'm really bad at it and I am aware of that. <laughs> I am totally aware of that. Have a look at Sam's. Let's go have a look at the calendar, see what's going on in summer. So Valentina and Wataru have a birthday. Connor's got a birthday. Eva and Emma. Sam, Dinda, Frank and Zara, Leah and Anne, and Yuri. We have a beach cleanup and an animal festival. Wonderful. So maybe if I can adopt an animal, I could take the animal to the festival. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I should try and aim to have animals before that date. Hmm, okay. Oh, look, everyone's in their summer looks. Is that Scott's summer look? <gasps> so good. Something strange is going on. The water gate in the cavern opened up. Should we look into it? Not that I'm, uh, you know, scared or anything. Ha, why would you even think that? Um, excuse me, but is my hair uh, messy? I hope not. Yeah, they've all changed their clothes for summer. I love it. Soria, I like your banana t-shirt. What a beautiful day for a swim. I took some sand from the beach the other day and used it in my latest painting. It seems fitting, you know, it is summer. I don't know much about Dipper yet. Or oh, Erica. Here comes summer. Well, that helped me to know you. It's going to be a sweaty summer, apparently. Has summer been kind to you, Sheila? We left some food on the counter last night and one of the cats ate it. It's probably not so kind, is it? Alright, give me my watering can. I need it. And then I need to go to Sam's place and get some seeds. First of first of a season is always going to be about that. Oh, look, Pablo's got a different suit on, a, a different outfit on as well. I like his summer outfit. It's nice. Okay. Retrieve upgraded tool. Now I need to see how that differs. Um, so I need to have on me to upgrade my hook. I'm going to need 20 wood and 5 bronze bars, but I could bring those over and get that started, actually. And then just continue to do things in the mines. But then I'll need to do my hoe and my axe after that. I'll try and get every keep everything upgraded together, but they're not as important by a long shot as the other three. So the pickaxe, the watering can, and the, and the scythe are so much more important. Um... Right, Sam's shop. I think I went a little bit in the wrong direction there. Let's have a chat to Ben. Look at Ben's cool summer look. I saw one of the statues isn't in the cavern anymore. Looks like the little fella decided to take a walk after all. Yeah, he did. I'm excited about the beach cleanup festival later this season. Are you? Summer, finally. Now I can read outside as much as I want. Ah, Summer, enjoy the heat and humidity, she lab. I feel great. They're really enjoying the summer sun, aren't they? There'll be some... Eva doesn't like the summer. I'll just have a small breakfast here before my doctor's appointment at noon. Right then, let's go to Sam's. I've got like six fields that I can ha uh, put things into. So let's see what the deal is. And also Sam has a new outfit as well. Everyone has. Everyone has a new outfit for summer. I love it. Shop. I can't upgrade my bag. It's going to cost me like 12 grand. It's ridiculous. So we've got wheat, gardenia, sunflower, corn, and hot pepper, and blueberry. Produces every four days. Right, so blueberry is another one that like produces. Seven days produces every three days. So the hot pepper I'm going to, because it's going to run through to autumn, I'm going to put those on the sprinkler spots. 
um, and then hope to get another sprinkler at some point. So I'm only going to get 16 of them. And like I say, I'm gonna to hope to get a sprinkler to put in the middle at some point. Now the blueberry seeds will only last all summer. So I'm going to get nine of those. Okay, so that's three of my six spots taken. I do want to get everything though. So if I, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six seven spots gonna be needed so okay it might just be a case of making some more scarecrows it seems like there's one two three four five six all the time I'm just going to make sure he doesn't have something like a, a tree seed or something. I'm wondering where my banana... I haven't been watering that banana tree. I hope that hasn't wilted. I haven't even looked at it. <gasps> I'll go and take a look at it now. was probably the reason for oh no I really hope that the fact that I had I... oh what's going on thank you all for coming to today's town meeting today's agenda is set up to the next round of cemetery cleaning oh to set up the next round of cemetery cleaning okay as you all know heavy rains needs to clog up our sewage Pablo and his brother worked hard to clear the sewers around town thanks to them we didn't have a bad flood this season's budget will also go into fixing a leaked roof at the community centre. Last on the agenda, the cemetery is showing a lot of moss. Let's face it, I need volunteers. Who's it going to be, folks? Oh, loads of people volunteering. Oh, great, thank you. Tomorrow at 10am then. Meeting adjourned. So maybe if I turn up at 10am... Pablo, don't leave yet. Sorry. This man right here, always the first to volunteer. What a fine young man. Here you go, son. Have some of my fish soup. I made plenty. Thanks, Mr. Mayor. I'm just trying to contribute. I have nothing but time. You have to forgive me for not giving more. Look at you, dear. So humble. Now, you must not think it that way. Instead, look at what you've given to the community, which is plenty. What a wise way to look at things. It's always great to hear perspectives from successful people. Oh, you. Always with the compliment. Ha, ha, ha. That's Pablo for you. I like Pablo. He's cool. Great. Let's get to planting then. Um, I'm never catching that thing. I swear. Yeah. So let's get to planting. Well, maybe next year I will. I swear I've forgotten something. Oh yeah, you know what would be a really good thing to do before I plant all of my seeds that I just got? Oh, should I have done this before I bought the seeds? Or just before I plant them? Oh, I don't know. Still, I've got the money for it and I think this would be a handy thing to do. I'm gonna go to the lab and I'm gonna upgrade the seeds. Um. It might be that I'm too late and that I should have thought of this prior to buying all the seeds. But that's that's just me, isn't it? Don't think of things that early. Don't think of things in advance. Don't think maybe I should upgrade that sort of thing before the end of the season. No, no, no. But I did think of it before planting them, so maybe it'll help. Upgrade produce quality. Oh, it takes two days to upgrade. Uh, okay. Well, I need to remember that then. I don't have enough coins either. 
So I'm just going to plant my summer crops. It's fine. It just means that the I'll get a little bit less money for them. Um, oh, oh, don't run away. Come back. Soldier beetle. That's new. Yes. Let's pop that into the uh, museum. Seems it's right around the corner. Yeah, hopefully we'll get quite a new, a few new like fish and uh, and the like. Yeah, I'm a bit sad about that. Maybe by the next time I have a round of planting, I'll have got the seeds upgraded. But I'm having to choose right now. I'm having to choose between seeds, tools, collection reward. Fish, insects, sharks, critters, artifacts, vintage artifacts, gems, fire gems, earth gems. So much stuff. I don't know if it tells me in my journal what like stuff I'm missing. That would be good if it did, wouldn't it? Notes. Badges. Extras. New extras because I just found bonbon, I think. Geodan, Axel, and Senja. So they're all extra characters, so they're not like real people, I guess. They're not like villager people. There looks to be a few different dudes that I haven't met yet either. Like I say, one that looks like a turnip too. Beastry, player, produce. This is all the produce I haven't got yet. <laughs> wow. It looks like there might be some spring crops that I haven't even un unlocked. Caught fish. Insects. Secreters. Oh, cool. So I can see if I'm getting close to having finished um, caught catching them all. And to be honest, that's not a bad little haul of insects, is it? That's not terrible. And I've got quite a few fish. Sea critters, I think. I don't think that they... So can I then sort of... I can see how many I've caught. The largest one I've caught. Um, what kind of catches you can make. Whether I've donated it or not, which I haven't with the tilapia. So I could do with actually getting another one of those at some point. So obviously, I needed to donate it straight to the goddess and the rainbow fish as well I donated to the goddess the lionfish I've donated and given to the goddess and shrimp and crab so we did do a few you know it's not the end of the world and then this is the artifacts I'm missing gems fossils I've got no fossils scavengeables I think there's a dig site I have to unlock before I can get the fossils So yeah, like as we go through the year, we'll be able to find scavenger balls like under the sea and we'll be able to find the different um, seasonal ones. Cool. Did I actually donate my item? No, I didn't. We're 11 to go now. I think now we're in summer, this should, this should be time to upgrade. I'll definitely be able to get different fish. I do need to do more fishing. I know. I don't really uh, want to do tons of fishing though. I want to like I want to do diving, but I suppose when I'm diving, I can do things. What is making that noise? I swear, something making a noise. I'm hearing it now. Hmm. It was like a beep kind of a noise. What I might try and do as well is uh, where I've got fertilizer. I might try and make make some more for later, but uh, you know what I've got, I may as well pop on. You know, not perfect yet with things, but I'm trying to do what I can where I can. 
So this one, I want, I want to make sure the ones that regrow are the most protected. Got wheat and corn. Corn is a regrower, so I'm going to put that next to it. And then all the ones that don't regrow. So corn, I'll go up here. wheat here and I'll try and make some more scarecrows as well though but if for any reason I can't make the scarecrows then I've at least protected the things that are going to come back over time so we've got flowers here and I'm hoping as well that maybe birds will like flowers less than other crops cool right so now let's give everything a water now I need to know is that yes it's like that, is it? That'll be a darn sight quicker. And seeing as we're not going to have um, a big seed planting until autumn, I'll probably just not uh, worry too much about that. By autumn, I'm definitely going to have that upgrade. So I think I'll upgrade my scrap hook first and then go on for the seed upgrade. Once I have 2,000 smackaroonies. Coral bucks. That was definitely a little faster. But uh, sprinklers will be the way to go if I can make them at all. So let's uh, have a look at my crafting. And see if scarecrows are, are going to be able to be made any extra ones. Scarecrow, scarecrow, scarecrow. I need a bit of wood. But yes, I can make them. So if I just chop down some trees. Make a... I think I need three more. I like to have one on every corner of each, of each plot. It seems to work fairly well. Uh, so I'll need one more tree, I think. Wonderful. So let's go and put that in the pro in the building mats chest, and let's. Craft three scarecrows. Pop them down. I know it's like overdoing the coverage, but I roll. Okay, they look they look neat like that. Ah, oh, that one's in the wrong place. So I've got my scarecrow army going on there. So everything should be protected. The birds shouldn't be coming after any of it. Um, I've spent all day doing this. No no time to dive today, apparently. I will be trying to dive. I've used a lot of my stamina up, though, as well. So that's, actually, that's why it's a good diving day and not a good water shaft day. Absolutely. might have enough to upgrade this the scrap hook but we'll do a bit of diving and then i'll hand the scrap hook in tomorrow provided i have enough money i think it's only been a thousand five hundred for most of the upgrades so it's two thousand for the lab upgrades so i need to put into the compost bin trash and organic items Seventy trash. I've got that was organic items. Probably things like seeds and stuff. I don't really want to be like putting my produce back into fertilizer, so. Let's see if fiber counts. If it doesn't, then I probably won't be 
making too much compost if I've got to put my crops back through. Okay, well, it's not taking the fiber. Please don't tell me it's taking something like else out of my... chests to make this. Let me just check my produce chest. So I've got four of basically everything. I worry because there is chest crafting in this. Enclosed chest and global inventory. So if I don't include the chest in the global inventory, then that saves my produce. Still making compost. My question is, what's it using? The hay, maybe? 16 hay there. Doesn't seem to be. See, Lou. Uh, I don't know if it was taking maybe kelp or sea mushrooms or something. Maybe it's just taking the trash. I don't, I'm not sure. That makes me really nervous that it's going to take something that I need. There's nothing in donations. There's nothing gone from monster loot that I can see. I don't think it can't take from produce because it's not in the global inventory. But I don't I don't think it's taking anything it shouldn't be taking. Okay, that is fine by me. We've had such a good episode this episode. I'm super, super duper happy with everything that's gone on. Um I feel like I might make one more scarecrow and maybe I could like get another uh another crop thing another a crop thing a field planted that's the one but i don't think i'm going to do anything else today i think taking the first of the season just for a, a crop planting day is absolutely fine to be honest with me um how to be a farmer with jeff smith let's see what jeff smith has to say hot pepper season i think did see these didn't we and the animal channel which is all about fodder for animals so i think we are going to end the episode there so let's go to bed i like to try i don't always remember but i like to try and go to bed and show you guys what happens on the day recap because then you can see what happened so scott and connor both increased in relationship we didn't make any money and that was about it that was all that happened but that's fine. Uh, so it is a new day and I will say goodbye to you all. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you all next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome. <laughs>